Sounds good. Okay, so welcome back. This is uh, Dr. Will. And I just wanted to do a quick update um, after I've had that recent, recent work done. Uh, just got the car back last night and I've had the, um, the Y-shaped part of the uh, exhaust, the front pipes done and the flanges. And as you can probably hear, there's no blowing at all. I'm very, very pleased. And um, they said that the back box was quite badly corroded, but it's actually okay for the time being. Um, so they said, um, best leave, leave alone for now. It might be okay for a couple of years, two or three years. So that's quite good. And if I don't live too near the coast, it should last a bit longer. So the first thing I've noticed is that it's a lot smoother and there's no, uh, I said, there's no noise. Uh, whilst the car was there, I got them to, um, uh, to do a service as well. So they've done the, they've done the brake pads. They've done the um, spark plugs, oil filter oil and filter, um, air filter, and yeah, that was it, I think. Oil filter, oil change, spark plugs, air filter, and um, go on. air filter and uh, brake pads. <laughs> Thanks. So uh, yeah, so he did say that the, um, he had to top up a litre of engine coolant which is not good, so it's escaping from somewhere. He couldn't see anything obvious. Um, so maybe it's through, maybe it's a split hose or something. So I need to keep an eye on that. The last seller did tell me that he had to often top up with uh, coolant. So we'll keep an eye on that. He also said that the uh, rocker cover gaskets um, might be on the way out because there was sign of, um, the signs of oil there are signs of oil um, on the old spark plugs. But other than that, I think she's good to go. So it's lovely to have her back. It's not that warm today, but I fancied having the roof down. We just had a lovely lunch and uh, life is good. It's interesting it does that buzzing. I don't quite know, it must be a common common thing with the Lexus. It's got brand new brakes, but the brakes still buzz for some reason. The battery seems to be okay at the moment. I haven't had any issues with that. Since I've disconnected, I'm not sure whether I mentioned in the last video, but I have since disconnected the uh, alarm sensor. Um, I've also disconnected the the light in the boot so that will probably make a difference uh, less draw on the battery the sun's trying to come out but it's just a little bit hazy and uh, it must still be a bit cold because as we were leaving the pub they were lighting the fire. Well, these roads are quite narrow, you know. Oh, this is a lovely uh, lookout. I'll, I'll change the camera later so you can see. Hmm, someone's having a bonfire. Oh, no one else here, that's strange. It must be because it's not very warm, maybe. Anyway, it'd be a good photo, photo shoot opportunity. In fact, if I spin the car around, you'll be able to see the view, maybe. It's not too hazy. There you go. Oops, the camera's falling down a bit. There you go. 
lovely view lovely lovely peaceful as well I'm just going to park up because it's a lovely uh, lovely spot here there we go so I just want you to listen to the engine so engine starts very smooth there's no blowing at all there's no blowing from the exhaust pipe at all so I'm very pleased with that shame I don't have a uh, um, a ramp to show you but there's no blowing at all of the exhaust here's just here's my baby again she's looking good the new number plate Here she is, fantastic, nice to have her back again. As I say, I'll put a picture up later to show you the, um, the new part of the exhaust. It was certainly a uh, a good cost saving exercise compared to uh, what Lexus were going to charge and also um, having to go up to uh, Leeds which I would have been prepared to have done but it wasn't really practical it's lovely how it whizzes through these lanes I think it's very good handling despite what uh, some of the critics have said <laughs> yeah that sounds really smooth that I, I didn't want a I didn't want a, uh, a noisy raspy exhaust I don't think that's what this car is all about quite honestly I think we're just meant to waft along in luxury and smoothness. So next job I need to sort out is uh, sort out the headlights, give those a nice clean to take away the yellowing. Um, I might look into the uh, rocker cover gaskets. And the big thing I wasn't sure about is the um, gearbox oil. Lexus say it's a sealed unit and never needs to be changed. However, this car has now done 140,000 miles and I know um, Matt from High Peak Autos always says the first thing he does is changes the gearbox oil. So I think that would be very wise. So I think I need to find someone who can, who can do that for me. Um, so what have I done? I've changed the tyres, two tyres, changed the brakes, I've had a service, I've had the exhaust sorted. Um, I'll need to establish or keep an eye at least on this water leakage. Oh, we're in the country, I can certainly smell manure. I think they've been spreading. If you had smell of vision, you'd certainly uh, sense that. But for now, I've got my baby back. Lovely to drive, lovely to go for a little cruise in the country. All we need now is a warmer weather and uh, we'll be laughing. So let's put the roof up. I'm going to put these mirrors in as well. So it's so smooth, it feels like an electric car when, you, when you're just idling. As the last guy said, he had to check sometimes whether, the, uh, whether he'd stored it or not. Right, just press the button, listen to that noise, wait for it to uh, ping again, and we know that the roof is up. I showed my friend earlier the roof, and he couldn't believe how quick and effective the roof was, once again for a 20-year-old car. So let's wait for that ping. There we go. Windows up.
engine off and we're home. So once again, if you've uh, enjoyed the video, please do like and subscribe. Thank you for um, sharing this time with me and um, I will no doubt be making another video again very soon. But in the meantime, enjoy the rest of the day. Have a good week and stay safe.